Mwangeze Leli, Chocha, Sinetemba, Twalo, Daniel Wosteisen and Dylan Valley are some of the creators that have headlined the Chavit Arts Center's Heritage Month program. The program which featured jazz, art, film and dialogue ends today with Yako Mir's choir performance on Cake Afrikaans poems and Willem Boshov's exhibition titled Word Woes. Gabi Ngobo is the curatorial director at the Chavit Arts Center at the University of Pretoria. She joins us now on Zoom to unpack the Centre's Heritage Month. Good morning, Gabby. Welcome to Morning Live. Thank you. Good morning. I mean, you've been in this position for almost a year. I think you were appointed in October last year. How would you describe the journey so far? Um, the journey has been um, at the Javed Art Centre has been exhilarating um, uh, and, uh, and, and quite exciting as we, you know, uh, uh, I mean, of course, uh, also frustrating because uh, of uh, you know the pandemic mm. and various lockdowns, um, but I, I think our team has really held together to create uh, uh, an exciting program for this year. Uh, we've we've had three openings um, of major exhibitions as well as public programs and, and educational programs um, that mediate those those exhibitions. So it has been. Uh, um, very busy uh, and very exciting. Yeah. Uh, speaking about programs, talk to us about the Heritage Month program. You're into its second week. What's been happening? Uh, what's been happening, we hosted uh, a reading by Dumi Mohorosi, moderated by Ati Georgia. Um, we, we've had a, a walkabout of Interfacing Heavens, which is one of our uh, exhibitions featuring George Mahashe and Lorenzo, uh, Vanessa Lorenzo. Um, uh, we've had um, uh, yesterday. We had a, a, an exciting screening of Dylan Valley's uh, Africaps film, um, which is a, an, an award-winning film, in conversation with uh, with uh, with Heritage Month, of, of course, and looking at the histories of uh, uh, of the language and, and its dialects um, and the intricacies and politics around that. Uh, and also in conversation, of course, because we have the, the retrospective of uh, Velen Boshov, mm. uh, where it goes, uh, which, uh, which, which delves in the, in the histories and the intricacies of, uh, of the Afrikaans um, language. Uh, yesterday, we also hosted a, a, a curatorial dialogue, mm -hmm. which was quite exciting um, because uh, the audience was participating in, um, in, in, in the dialogue, giving us, you know, also uh, opportunities to hear from, uh, from them in terms of like what they think about what we've put out. Uh, so uh, it, was, it was quite uh, exciting. It has been two years since the Javed Art Centre has been open. Yeah. So yesterday we were celebrating our birthday yeah. uh, as well, yes. Another exhibition, Handle with Care, is also up at the centre. Talk to us about that. Handle with Care is, a, is an exhibition of selected works from, um, from a, a South 32 uh, collection, which is on loan to us for a period of 10 years. South, South 32 is a mining and, 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 and minerals company, and they started this collection in 1994, which is a, a, a critical year in our history, um, so um, and and these works by uh, very well known and lesser known South African artists, but also artists from across the borders, from Angola, uh, even U the United States, even Malaysia, which is quite amazing and, and surprising at, at, at times. Um, and this exhibition is divided into four themes, which is the rituals of self-preservation. Uh, dreamscapes, mm -hmm. um, the, the constructions of masculinities, and uh, and abstractions. Um, some of the artists in 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 in, uh, in in this collection and in this exhibition include Mahabo, Helen Sibidi, David Goloane, Pet Maudra, Penisio Peace, uh, Sabelum Langeni, uh, George Mahashe again. So it's um, it's it's packed with. With, with historical material that is very exciting to to move through in in, in like four five or four of our galleries. Look, every time there's Helen Sibidi and Pet Mauta in one room, you don't have to uh, tell me twice. <laughs> I want to go back to William Boshov's word woes, and you spoke about how uh, Afrikaans is being touched there. But what other issues does he highlight uh, in word woes? 
Um, Wellenbuschhoff is known as a, you know, um, quote-unquote word terrorist. Yes. So really, um, he really is interested in, in the intricacies of language, mostly Africans, but not only Africans. Um, Africans, the, the, the exhibition is titled Word Wars, mm. which is an English uh, uh, a title, but it also can be read in Africans, word vows. So it, within the title itself, you can um, sort of uh, uh, understand uh, the intricacies that he thinks within um, the languages that he he works with also uh, is English um, in relationship to, to Africans, but also other uh, indigenous uh, South African uh, languages. Mm. Um, and, and also, I, I mean, he's also a beautiful crafts person um, who has a, a background in, uh, in, 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 in building, you know, from, from which is a craft that he, he learned from, 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 from his father, yeah. um, building in wood and, and crafting. So the exhibition is quite beautifully uh, um, executed but also spends uh, 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 a, a long time in his career with the, an earliest work from 1976 to the latest work in uh, 2021. So he's been working actively for all these years. Yeah. Let's talk about today's program, Yako Mayer's uh, choir performance. Tell us a little bit about that. Uh, Yako Mayer has been working with uh, um, with Velen Bosho for a number of years. They've been um, um, collaborating um, so what is happening today is a culmination of those years uh, collaboration in response to uh, a work from the 80s, which is uh, titled Gay Afrikaans. Um, he has assembled a choir um, with, uh, with music that, that respond to that particular work from the 80s, but also to, um, to, to, to the exhibition itself in its entirety. There is a work uh, from 2021 or finished in 2021, which is titled The Death of Africans, um, which, you know, brings, brings uh, in um, a kind of like different discussions um, ab about this language. And it's, you know, um, not necessarily its death, but like how it could be re- interpreted and rethought and uh, and to include everybody that speaks it um which is uh, uh beyond you know what mm. is usually known about the language all right Gabingobo, thank you so much for talking to us she's the uh, curatorial director of the javid art center mm -hmm. at the university of pretoria speaking to us about the center's program for heritage month which included jazz art film and dialogue so you if you are in pretoria uh, check them out